Hi, in this video, we will learn every point in the section, What did liberal nationalism stand for? Part 1. This comprises seven questions. Question 1. In Dash Europe, the ideas of national unity were closely allied to the ideology of liberalism. The options are late 19th century, late 18th century, early 18th century, early 19th century. Your time to choose. And the answer is early 19th century. So, in early 19th century Europe, the ideas of national unity were closely allied to the ideology of liberalism. Question 2. In early 19th century Europe, the dash were closely allied to the ideology of liberalism. The options are ideas of monarchy, ideas of national unity, ideas of freedom, ideas of abolition of aristocratic privileges. Your time to choose. And the answer is ideas of national unity. So, in early 19th century Europe, the ideas of national unity were closely allied to the ideology of liberalism. Question 3. In early 19th century Europe, the ideas of national unity were closely allied to the dash. The options are ideology of territory, ideology of masses, ideology of liberalism, ideology of nationalism. Your time to choose. And the answer is ideology of liberalism. So, in early 19th century Europe, the ideas of national unity were closely allied to the ideology of liberalism. Question 4. The term dash is derived from the Latin word liber. The options are masses, liberalism, socialism, democracy. Your time to choose. And the answer is liberalism. So, the term liberalism is derived from the Latin word liber. Next, question 5. The term liberalism is derived from the dash word liber. The options are Latin, Sanskrit, German, French. Your time to choose. And the answer is Latin. So, the term liberalism is derived from the Latin word liber. Question 6. The term liberalism is derived from the Latin word dash. The options are novo, liber, 
Domino Rex. Your time to choose. And the answer is liber. So, the term liberalism is derived from the Latin word liber. Question 7, last question. The term liberalism is derived from the Latin word liber, which means dash. The options are open, free, nation, unity. Your time to choose. And the answer is free. So, the term liberalism is derived from the Latin word liber, which means free. Okay, so in this video, we learnt every point in the section, What did liberal nationalism stand for? Part 1. In the next video, we will learn every point in the section What did liberal nationalism stand for? Part 2. I'll see you there.